Okay, good morning YouTube. I am here at work. Um, as usual, the first one here, it is, um, let's see, it's 623. I don't start to 730. And the reason why I get here so early is because I try to beat the traffic because traffic is atrocious here in LA. So I leave early so I don't have to get so frustrated driving um, in the traffic and also have to get gas. So, but yeah, I am here at work. I am getting ready to go get breakfast to start my day to fuel my engine. <laughs> that way I have a good day. Um, my son didn't wake up for me this morning, but that's okay. I was able to kiss him. Um, see you later, basically. And of course, my husband walked me out this morning. I didn't film that this morning because it's so dark and, you know, it. the footage isn't that good. And I decided to mess around with this camera until I got it right because the last few vlogs I was looking a little plastic <laughs> and I was trying to fix that and I hope I did I think I did this time so yeah you guys I will talk to you soon okay talk to you later. okay what's going on YouTube I am just now leaving work and um, again I'm a little exhausted because it feels like I have to walk 50 miles to get to my car park so far away from the office so yeah I'm just getting on the road here I'm on my way to the freeway hopefully traffic isn't too bad you know the anticipation of getting to my son <laughs> is always high so that's a good thing have something to to come home to my son and my husband yeah so hopefully traffic isn't too bad and um, you know I'll get there in good time also um, I hadn't put out any videos I hadn't uploaded any videos like because I was uploading like every other day but the last few days you know the footage like my last two videos I my family we look very plastic so I had to mess with the settings of this camera and you know try to figure things out so we're not looking so plastic so hopefully this go around you know the the images are a lot better and we don't look like we're melting or we look like plastic yeah so it took me a little bit to figure things out again I'm new to this um, whole vlogging thing so you know I'm just really used to using the camera for taking pictures video is slightly different for me but I think I may have figured it out of course there's room for improvement there is always going to be room for improvement but as far as the, as you no know, as the images are you know my family looking plastic I think I may have fixed that so hopefully the quality is a lot better next time so yeah I'm gonna go ahead and concentrate on the road here make sure I get to my destination safely and um, oh, the police is pulling someone over <laughs> Yeah, made sure I get to my destination safely and I will speak to you guys either when I pick up my son or um, when I get home, okay? So talk to you guys soon. Okay, what's going on YouTube? I just picked up my son and his childcare is really close to our house so it's very convenient for us, especially in the morning time. Yeah. So, yeah, child care is maybe two minutes away. It's not that far. But, yeah, he's in the back seat trying to figure out who I'm talking to. <laughs> yeah, but um, I literally just left. So, you guys are going to be able to see how long it takes us to get to the house from child care. Yeah, so... I love picking him up because he always greets me with this big greeny smiles and jumps for me. It's it's it makes me feel good as a mom. Yeah. And it's hot. It's supposed to be spring. It's 82 degrees, y'all. 82 degrees. It's it's hot. Whew. You can probably hear him in the background. He's probably like, it's hot, mama, it's hot. <laughs> Yep, but I'm going to stay here with you guys so that you will see how it doesn't take me that long to get home from his child care. I'm sitting at a light, 
So that can delay the process a little bit. But yeah, I'm sitting at a light right now. It's so hot. I think I need to put the air conditioning on. Woo! Because if I roll down the window, you guys won't be able to hear me. Let me cut the air on. Climate. Oh no, it's okay. to sit here and wait for the cars to sorry <laughs> yeah just bear with me you guys I'm getting ready to back into my driveway these cars are looking at me like <laughs> yep yeah. so we are home <laughs> doesn't take us that long at all so i uh, will speak to you guys when we get okay what's going on youtube we are now at home um as usual my little one is down resting i've already bathed him and he's having his bottle and he's resting. Oh. Hey, Booters. You say hi. <laughs> say hi. You say hi. No? Okay. Yeah, so he's resting and my husband's in the kitchen cooking. And we're winding down now. I'm going to get a little comfortable. Um, yeah, just get a little comfortable because it's hot. Like I said earlier, it's like 82 degrees outside. So I'm going to go ahead and get comfortable and I'll talk to you guys soon. Okay, what's going on YouTube? I'm going to go ahead and end the video here. Um, everyone's down. I, my son has been asleep since 7.30. And my husband is now in, in the bed and I'm getting ready to go to bed. So I'm going to go ahead and end this video here. Um, I would say today was a productive day. Um, no problems or no issues throughout the day, so it was a good day for me. Um, work was good as well. The drive home was okay. Lots of traffic, but that's normal for me. But the drive home was okay. Um, yeah, so I wanted to go ahead and do, excuse me, a current event. And um, this one is a little funny, so you guys let me know what you think about it. I'm going to read it, okay? So just let me know what you think. Okay, so it says, a 26-year-old woman in Florida claimed that a windy day was the reason why cocaine was in her back. Fort Pierce authorities stopped a swerving car in late March and questioned passenger Kanisha Posse, this, the station explained. Police said an officer smelled marijuana, and while going through the car, marijuana and cocaine were discovered in the bags in Percy's purse. And so she simply said, Posse reported and said the marijuana belonged to her. And it says, I don't know anything about any cocaine. The station quoted her saying to the police, it must have flown through the window and into my purse. So what do you think about that? I thought that was the funniest thing when I read the story. So she claimed the marijuana, I'm assuming because marijuana is legal in most states, but she didn't claim the cocaine. She said it magically blew into her purse when the window was rolled down. So I thought that was a silly reason to tell the police officer why she had cocaine on her. Um, you guys let me know what you think. I just thought it was really silly. I wanted to say thank you so much for watching. Um, please subscribe if you haven't already. Thumbs up my video and I will see you in my next video. Thank you for watching.